Alright guys, I'm back again and today we're gonna talk about my top 5 Top 5 Light and Darkness units in the game uh, So oh, this video will help you to choose which is the best LDs in the event so this will bring the focus on the nut trees and I will not include the nut uh, you know the free to play LDs that you can get on uh, secret dungeons so this is my top 5 personal opinion okay oh I do acquire which one did I acquire here? Yeah. The Light Griffin, I think. Yeah, okay, before we start, let's just check this. And then let's just sell everything. Like that. Okay. So here's my top five. Top five. It will be Train. Why? Because of the dots and control. I mean, and lots of turns, you can do lots of turns in. I suggest you rune him on speed, HP, HP, violent, uh, violent focus or violent whatever. Just focus on getting him tanky and then having a really decent accuracy. Because after this turn, you can do this and then you can instantly stun team, stun enemies. Like... And then if you're lucky, you'll get violent proc, you're gonna hit this, and then you'll get another violent proc, you do this, and then again, you do this. Okay, Doomsday. It's like turn cycling. Plague plus Doomsday, Plague plus Doomsday. And then you partner it with this guy, Sat. I use this mainly for like uh, Guild War and Siege, and TOA hard, and TOA normal. TOA normal, no, because I run a fast team, so... This is one of the best. Sometimes I use this on RTA. Special League, he's also good. So definitely get this guy. And then instantly second awaken him. So top 4, let's go top 4. Top 4 would be this Gina. Gina, really good control unit. And also a poison to remove one and has trip really good uh, rune him with despair speed HP HP one of the best unit light and darkest unit in the game and sleep I think this one is sleep yeah somebody uh, continues to for to learn the last hard dish push them 60% chance really amazing unit but you need the stripper to to do this to make this skill land okay so if you don't have her, I suggest you pick this. Who else? Top three would be this. Miho. If you don't have him if you don't have her, I suggest you get one and instantly to a him her and because of this passive you can just kill this this uh, lady because of her passive everyone builds like high crit rate in arena good for RTA and good for siege battle sometimes sometimes uh, my enemies put this on his team and then I instantly don't know what to do because all of my teams are built with high crit rate you always crit this lady no matter what you do no matter if you have 50% trip rate sometimes you still crit her and then if you have 20% sometimes you still crit her and definitely can solo the whole team easy okay let's go top two top two would be this Shaman. Shaman is one of the best units in the game. Why? Because of his use case, you can use on on Necro. I'm using this on Necro. Yeah. 
oops sorry and you can also use on this yeah and also use on ruin of silent it really good and sometimes people use him on yeah I've seen people use him on siege also really hard hitting unit it, it ha hits hard on dark units and it has heal and sustain if you don't have if you don't have shaman you definitely want to get him because of his use case next my top one this one is my top one a sheer I use him on Arena, RTA, Siege, and Guild War. Really great unit. Let me show you how I use this. Just slap in your fastest sweep set on that guy, and then you can just easily kill lots of people in uh, in in Arena. Let's see. Let's use this. If you want to go first. Need to pick this Ashir, one of the best units in the game. Okay, let's do this. Strip, and then do this, and then hopefully Galleon lands everything. Yep. Then do this, just like that. Easy. Easy clap. So that's my top 5 LDs in the game. So I suggest you if you don't you still don't have S here you get one. One of the best LDs in the game. So that's it and I'll see you on the next one guys. Thank you.